Dress causes girl to get left out on picture day. It all started with her outfit. She couldn't understand what was wrong with it, but her mom would reach her boiling point when she saw the note. She had heard of school dress codes backfiring terribly. But when her daughter came home early in tears, and with a scathing note from one staff member, she could only see red. She would not sit by and do nothing. Mrs. Darling knew picture day was a big deal. She had already gone through the ritual with both daughters for years. It wasn't just about school time memories, but something she could hang on the wall or send to grandparents. But this year was extra special. It might not have sounded like much, but when the three of them went shopping for that special outfit, her eldest daughter had something in mind. She wanted to buy something for her youngest, Vegas. But there was the issue of the dress code. The list was already ridiculously long, but Darling kept track of the skirt length and other nitpicks. It was still hot in Billings, Montana, so there were plenty of pretty, floral items that would do the trick. She had no idea that the one they would choose would cause a huge stink in the school. Darling couldn't help but grin as Vegas spun around in the new dress and then gave her sister a huge hug to say thank you. The happiness carried all the way over to the end of the week when the cameras came out. The little girl, however, would not get a photo. It started with the sound of someone coming through the front door, far too early for her girls to be home. But there Vegas stood, crying her eyes out in the middle of the living room. The girl sniffed and held out a piece of paper to Darling, looking like she was about to get in trouble. Darling scanned the note, but only made it halfway through before steam shot out her ears and she was ready to strangle someone. Her daughter had not only been kicked out for the day, but they had also refused to take her photo. The reason. The dress. But the note had more. Either someone was having a bad day at school, or they had no idea how to talk to parents. The note had heavy connotations about poor parenting, disregard of rules, and even went as far as saying Vegas was a distraction to the boys and wasn't welcome back until everyone in the family knew better. She wrapped her crying girl up in a blanket, turned on the television, and brought her a cup of hot chocolate. It was all she could do as the rage pumped through her veins. But things were about to get worse. Darling immediately called her mom, Vegas grandmother, to ask for a second opinion before the furious mother dropped some sort of nuclear reaction on the school. But what was the dress that caused all the fuss? Even Darling's mother agreed it was nonsense. But when she called the school, they stood firm with their actions and even sent a photo as evidence. Someone had actually taken a picture of Vegas bawling her eyes out at school right after she had been scolded. It was too much. Darling and her mother immediately went to social media, hoping for public support and intervention from some higher education power. The entire debacle was because the girls' shoulders were showing. What was the public reaction? The response was overwhelming. Everyone agreed the school had not only gone too far, but they had also shamed and embarrassed a young girl. There had been no violations before. She had also only been allowed in the class photo if she wore a sweater over top. But what was the school's reaction? The answer was as short as it was cold. The case was closed because the girl had worn a sweater over top. They did nothing to address the shame and spotlight they had thrown on the girl, not the evidential photo they had snapped. Darling was beyond irritate. Despite the public outcry, it seemed the school wasn't going to do anything. But she wasn't going to let it go. Next picture day, she was sending Vegas to school in a witch costume and would wait to hear what they said about that.